We've got the clouds, the fog, everything that we've seen so far this week is back for another day uh, really into the weekend. So probably at least the next I would say 48 hours we're dealing with the clouds again and the overcast skies. We've got the fog outside already. As we go into your Thursday night, pretty uh, foggy view here from Lamoni. Same for uh, the fairgrounds up in Algona. We've got some dense fog there as well. The rain continues most of it along and then to the east of I-35 here. We've got heavier showers up towards northeast and eastern Iowa. Some more moderate rain steady at times picking up through places like Ames into Story County down into Ankeny, Des Moines, out into portions of Dallas County and then points further to the south and east. We still have steady rain all across the southeastern quadrant of the state down towards uh, places like Pella, Oskaloosa, back into Warren County as well. So we've got wet weather sticking around here through the afternoon and into the early evening hours tonight. A healthy dose of rain though. So far rainfall totals up to about a quarter of an inch here in Des Moines. That's also the case for places like Lamoni, Centerville, almost a third of an inch over towards Grinnell, and we are at a third of an inch up towards Marshalltown. So good news there as far as our rainfall totals go. We'll add to that as the rain continues here this evening, plus with the melting snow. Visibility wise, though, it's still limited in a lot of spots down to about a third of a mile in Newton. That is also the case for Sheridan. Uh, Osceola and Perry are down to about a mile visibility there. So keep that in mind if you do have plans to travel tonight. Dense fog advisory in place again through tonight into the start of your day on Friday. So just like today, we're back to the fog and the cloud cover as you're waking up tomorrow morning. The rain does end overnight tonight, but the clouds stick around. Temperatures will hang back right around freezing or so through early tomorrow morning. We head into the day on Friday. It starts off foggy. Winds will stay light all day long and we'll keep the gloomy skies as well. we'll temperatures just like today will be back up into the mid 30s. So our by our forecast looks like this rain eventually does come to an end here later on tonight. It'll linger for a little bit longer across eastern Iowa through maybe uh, the pre dawn hours on Friday. Then we're stuck with the cloud cover for everyone through the day on Friday. I think tomorrow is dry for the most part, but the clouds will linger and then we're back again to the cloudy skies heading into the first part of your weekend. I think we'll see a little more rain here as we go through the rest of tonight into tomorrow, but those heavier totals focused across the eastern half of the state. Next couple of days, we are in the mid 30s tomorrow. I think it's going to be mostly dry as we get into the daylight hours, but the fog and clouds linger. Same for Saturday, dry day temperatures back to the mid 30s. So tonight, low 30s right around freezing again this evening. Tomorrow back up to the mid 30s, still above average for this time of year, but really no variation in our temperatures at all this week. We stay in the low 30s through Sunday. The 40s return with the sunshine starting as early as Tuesday next week. We'll keep it in the mid 40s for the middle part of uh, the work week next week.